normal PSA. There is no normal PSA cutoff value as such. However, the most commonly quoted study that many urologists base their practice on is that of Osterling and Al, which reported the normal PSA values that correspond with different age ranges, as shown in table here. So for patients between the ages of 40 and 50, the upper limit of the normal value of PSA is 2.5. It's 3.5 for patients between the ages of 50 and 60, 4.5 between the ages of 60 to 70, and 6.5 between 70 and 80. There are several studies which reported the correlation of different ranges of PSA with prostate cancer. Of these, we mentioned the study by Catalona et al., which showed that 26% of patients who have PSA between 4 and 10 have prostate cancer, and 53% of patients with PSA more than 10 have also prostate cancer. Furthermore, the prostate cancer prevention trial, which is a landmark trial, reported a high percentage of prostate cancer in men with PSA less than 4, whereas 25% of such patients were reported to have prostate cancer, which is rather alarming. Further, moreover, Gerstin Blath and Al reported on the predictive value of high levels of, of PSA more than 20 for detecting prostate cancer, and they reported 87% chance of having prostate cancer in patients with PSA levels higher than 20, and 100% chance of having prostate cancer in those with PSA levels higher than 50 nanogram per milliliter.